demons of the jury, how do you find the prisoners? Uh, guilty or not guilty? Guilty. 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 What a mess. The last robot disappeared on May 27th, and here it is August, and we're no near to the answer. Well, let me get this straight, Commander Zero. Four planets have reported that their top robots have just vanished into thin air. That's right, Steve. Vanished without trace. The governments of these planets are screaming for action. But we can't act if we have no clues. Yeah. Where could the robots go? And why? It beats me, Steve. Oh, hi, Matt. We're just talking about the missing robots. You got any theories? Well, uh, maybe we should ask Professor Al Himber. The robot expert? But why ask him? Well, it may be just a coincidence. But on his recent lecture tour, each one of the planets he visited lost their top robot. That sounds interesting. Well, he's due to arrive to lecture at Space City this evening. I think this calls for a plan of action, gentlemen. The warning device is ready, Steve. I'll just get it fixed to Robert's circuit. Steve, do you really think that Professor Himber will try to steal Robert? Well, look at it this way, Venus. We suspect him of taking those other four robots. And they were the best on each planet. Now, Robert is Earth's best robot, so he may try to steal him. I see. And Matt's device will give us a warning. But how does he do it? Well, that we don't know, Venus. But remember... He's a genius with robots. If any man could do it, he could. And in conclusion, I would like to say how much I admire the work of your very own Professor Matthew Matic. Indeed. I would go so far as to say that Professor Matic's invention, known affectionately as Robert the Robot, is perhaps one of the finest mechanical creations of our modern world. Beautiful creation. Very soon it will be mine. Now, to put my plan into operation. Wait, what is this? <laughs> the fools. The Zodiac and Matic think I'm as primitive as they. An alarm system. Really, Professor Matic. You'll have to do better than that. <laughs> Professor Himber's spaceship has lifted off A-OK, -okay, Commander. Roger, Lieutenant. Well, Steve, uh... Guess we can count out Professor Himber. Robert's okay. Yeah. I guess we're back where we started. Without a lead on those missing robots. Let's get back to the control room. Well, Steve, guess we better return to our previous procedure. Lieutenant 90, alert the XL-1 crew. They're the next ship on patrol. But sending out our patrol ships to search for missing robots is getting us nowhere. Steve, there's a certain routine in these matters. And I'm following that routine. Prepare XL-1 for liftoff, Lieutenant. Roger, Commander. Launch area, Commander. XL-1 can, can proceed to launch rail. XL-1 
Cell 1 in launch position, Commander. Okay, Lieutenant. Robert. We must stop him. I'll use the remote controls on your desk, Commander. Sure, Professor. 